Welcome to the Rusted Garden. Today I want to show you what aphids are, how to identify them, and how to treat them. As you start, these are my eggplant, and as you start taking your plants outdoors to get acclimated to the sun, there's going to be a chance pests come along, and aphids are pretty common. They're nothing to really to worry about. If you look on these leaves, you can see all these little green specks. Those are aphids. And on this leaf, right, oh, where'd it go? Let me hunt around for it real quick. I'll find it in a second, but let me show you some more of the aphids. Most of the aphids don't have wings. They just get on your plant and suck the sap out of them. But every once in a while, it's sort of like a queen, it's not technically, but there's a winged version of the aphid that will come, and that's the version that flies from your plants. You can see tiny ones right there, a whole mess of them right here. These are just the plain aphids, and what they do is they suck the sap out of your plant. Look at all the aphids under there. I mean, they basically fall off as I tap them. What you'll find sometimes is you'll find a winged version of the aphid. That aphid will fly from your plant leaf to your plant leaf. And there you go. There's one right there by my thumb. That one will fly, like I said, leaf to leaf and lay uh, eggs all over your leaves and spread the aphids around. The way that you treat them is just use a soapy water spray. Uh, about one quart, just like this. Put in maybe a teaspoon of uh, dish soap. Check out my videos. It'll explain how you make the soapy water spray. I also put some neem oil in here, but you don't need that. Because these are soft-bodied insects, the soapy water spray basically dehydrates them very quickly and kills them off. The soap is very, very effective. And all you do is soak the underside of the leaves down really well. Now I'm in the sun for the video, but don't do this in full sun, especially with plants you're just taking outdoors because the combination of the spray and the sun will damage your leaves. So once that's done, take them indoors, let them dry, and then you can bring them back outside. For plants that are outside and used to the sun, it's fine. You can spray them whenever you want to. But just soak the plants down and make sure even if you don't see them on the other plants, you would do all the plants. Do this, you know, today, maybe again tomorrow, and you'll have no more aphids. Hope you enjoyed the video and it gives you some idea of the pests that may show up on your plants and how you can treat them. Please check out my blog at www.therustedgarden.blogspot.com and also check out my YouTube videos. Thanks.